Hi. Um, so probably, probably gonna get heat for it, but whatever, it's gotta be said. <laughs> I can take it. Um, so this thought occurred to me, and it's something that I've kind of been observing, I think patterns over the years. And what I've noticed is when a lot of people come to the yoga space, they're, they're coming for a reason. They're coming for physical benefits. They're coming for um, healing benefits. And, and that's good. I mean, that's why I came to this space mm -hmm. to begin with. Um, but what I'm seeing in the pattern is that a lot of people approach this healing or this fixing of themselves with this very stringent, um, rigid attitude. And I, I want to let you know that stringency and consistency, sometimes related, aren't the same thing. Sorry, I got a dog here shaking. Um, so when you're coming to your practice, you're really coming for that, that yoga, that yoking of the mind, body, and spirit. And sometimes your mind, body, and spirit will be asking for maybe a different kind of practice or a gentler practice or less practice or no physical mat practice. And that is part of your journey is to figure out that union of your mind, your body, your spirit, your emotions. You are yoking those together and you are determining what is right for you. And so the caution and the stringency is A, you're not you're your own ally, so don't beat yourself into submission because it's not going to work, um, at least not long term. And then B, if you're looking for any sort of like a guru, a teacher, somebody else to have the answers for you, none of us have all the answers, right? So we might be able to provide insight. We might be able to point in a direction, but it's not for us to do. And you're not supposed to do exactly what we tell you to do. We really shouldn't be telling you to do all the things anyhow. We're just here as guides. Um, so if you're newer to the practice, um, I, I hope that you keep those things in mind, you know, and keep, keep your authority and autonomy as you're on your journey to figure out um, what feels best for you, what you can trust um, in your gut. Um, yeah, and just being, being true to yourself no matter what. It doesn't mean being easy on yourself. Um, it doesn't mean brutalizing yourself. Um, it doesn't mean listening to everything that other people have to say. It does definitely mean, though, listening to your own self and your own gut. So, yeah, it's a babble, but it's been on my mind, so... Crucify me if you will. <laughs>